Now, on Tuesday evening, a little after 5 p.m., a, a Good Samaritan citizen was tra tra traveling on Price Distillery Road, uh, noticed a, a adult male pit bull, um, pulled her car to the side of the road, exited. Um, in the process of putting the male pit in her vehicle, uh, also observed off the roadway, uh, beyond the shoulder, seven puppies that were aging approximately four months of age. All appear to be somewhat underweight, uh, malnourished, as well as dehydrated. They do have a skin condition. Um, they were transported from the Price Distillery Road address to a local veterinarian who did a preliminary examination and then obviously because of the skin, skin condition then uh, prescribed some medication that we are providing to them. Uh, the ownership of those dogs we're, we're interested in and we're hoping that uh, a citizen or someone in the community will be able to assist us in determining possible ownership. Uh, we are conducting an investigation and would like to talk to the owners. Uh, obviously, to their benefit is the fact that they are only four months of age. The detriment to them, unfortunately, is that they are of the pit bull breed, not that our shelter is breed specific with regards to any particular breed, but it would be premature for me to make a statement today that they are without a doubt unadoptable. It, it would appear from an initial uh, day and a half observation that we've not seen anything that would not make them adoptable other than what we said earlier with the mange. I mean that is something that a person that were to adopt would have to understand the level to which medical things would have to occur to eliminate the mange in the dog. If there is someone who in viewing this has an idea of possible ownership if they would call 301-600-1544 that's a number to our animal control officer uh, line and if they wanted to remain anonymous but provide information as to possible ownership that information would be advantageous and uh, assist us in our investigation as we continue forward. First and foremost, if we can determine ownership, that would be outstanding. Um, but again, if people uh, viewing the video or citizens of our county or even adjoining counties are interested in adoption, we always accept applications. Uh, that puts a hold on the animal. And then from there, then if the animal becomes adoptable, then we follow the adoption process. And the one good thing about demodictic mange is the fact that um, it is non-contagious to humans so, and, and to other animals. But, um, so that's the plus of it. The bad thing, as we said earlier, is the fact that it is a substantial lengthy treatment to, uh, to resolve that issue.